Subscribe now. Hello everybody, Matt Slash here, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Last couple episodes, we uh, we were doing some challenge runs, and uh, well, after completing uh, three of them, what was it, the tank, waka waka, and slow roll, uh, I think now we move on to maybe doing a couple of regular runs, and then, uh, you know, we'll hit back on some challenges. Yeah. Go ahead and get ready on this. Let's go back to random, and let's see who we are. Samson. Okay, we haven't done anything with Samson yet, so this would be, be nice. And we have Curse of the Maze, which... Yeah, it's not that bad. Now, with Samson, um, he... He's a... Uh, uh, it's hard to say. He can be a pretty good character. He can also be a little challenging. Now, he does work off the basis that if you receive damage... His damage stat does go up. And that's for the entire floor. So if we actually get some red hearts on the ground, like you see there we got we have the uh, the half heart. And we find a way to Oh my goodness. And we just unlocked this. Death touch. Ooh, yes. So it's got penetrative shots. Plus we got a damage up. Very nice. But, um, what we can do is try to take meaningful damage. And what I mean by meaningful is a blood donation machine or a sacrifice room, curse room right here, for instance. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, boy. Okay. I know what to do here. I know exactly what to do here. We're going to take Guppy's Paw. One, two, three. Take nine lives. We have an extra red heart. <laughs> we have lots of health right now. Uh, yes, we've taken a little bit of damage. You can see the, that Samson has... Well, he's kind of pink now. He'll he'll keep getting darker and darker until you cap at a certain... Um, a certain rate. There we go. we got Monstro. I love Death's Touch. Decent little damage up. Piercing shots. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. And then to think we already found two guppy items. So two of three. We are set up to have a really good run here. I mean, yeah, and... and we got tears upgrade, so yeah, we are getting set up. Now, the downside is we do not have a key. We do not have a bomb or anything, but hopefully we can find one on the next floor. All right. Uh, again, curse room. And we, we did it. So yeah, we are. <laughs> We're already guppy. Um, I'm going to stick with, I think I'm going to stick with Guppy's Paw, actually. Just because we can use that if we want to for more soul hearts. As long as we have the red heart containers to get rid of. Uh, we also have flight. That's pretty cool. Now what I'd like to see is, uh, okay, we don't have a key. Uh, I would like to see... Spectral Tears. That would just really set us up on this run. Uh, I'm going to do it in hopes we could get a key. We did not, unfortunately. Okay, Monstro's already gone. We do get a couple of Soul Hearts, so that's, that's nice. You see Guppy just... I mean, yeah, we're good. We are good. I'll, I'll take Lucky Rock for now. We don't have any other trinket, so it doesn't hurt. We are doing so much damage, and we get an amnesia, which is it's it's fine, honestly. 
Come on. We need some keys here. That That's really what I want to see right now. And we get goat head. My goodness. Like. I think this is going to be like one of the more powerful runs we will ever see. At least as of right now, that's what's shaping up to be. Goat head. Death's touch. We have guppy. You know, toothpick. Like we've asked for things and we have been receiving them. The only thing we are falling short on are our consumables. Now, I'm going to use this key. I, I could go to the shop. But I'm going to use it for the item room. And we get spider baby. All right. Not the best item, but it's not a bad item. Here we go. Let's keep on going. Get up to our boss room. And we're going to be fighting Larry Jr. I feel bad for them right now. Already done. And we get another damage upgrade. Um. Yeah. Sure. Let's see what's in here. Just some red chest. I mean, we already have Guppy. But it doesn't hurt. And I mean, sure, I'll take Guppy's tail also. Let's head on down. If we can continue to cruise through this run like we are and can make it to boss rush, I don't see why we shouldn't attempt it. I mean, honestly, I'll go ahead and use the world card. Go. Really want some consumables. Now, I know Guppy's tail can kind of go against that. But I'm what I'm hoping is that we'll get some steel chest. Like that. And we get some consumables. Just like that. And here's another key. Very good. Uh, Charm tears with mom's eyeshadow. I don't know if that's actually a tears up or not. I don't think it is. But it does help. Regardless. So... Uh, get the bomb. Yeah, we can grab that too. Uh, I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to. Yep, uh, I shouldn't have. Um, ah, eh, we're good. Okay, we got Chubb here. This is, like I said, these next couple of fights are going to be super easy. I mean, look at that. Just so easy. And we get another tears upgrade thanks to Squeezy. And we get an angel deal. Interesting. Um. You know what? Yeah. Let, let's let's take that. Let's blow up the angel here. Oh, we can't do that yet. Darn it. Yeah, we can do that. Alright, so we are making excellent time. What's cool is that we are also taking half the cost of a curse room since we have flight. Like I said, this is all thanks to Guppy. My only complaint right now in this run is literally just the lack of consumables. That's that's all it is. Lack of consumables. Go. Nice. Okay, not even gonna worry about that. I feel like we are heading straight to the boss right now. Which is fine. Okay, we're not. It's a giant dead end. <laughs> I'm just gonna pick that up. Heal for the half. I don't want to make my way back down here if I do not have to. 
It's just another way for the game to, uh, well, use up our time. We get tears up there and a telepills. Um, no, I'm going to hold on to the key, use it on a item room, if at all possible. You know, I will hold on to this bombs or key pill. You never know. We might get some bombs and need keys. That is a possibility right now. Ooh, another key. Very good. There's a bomb. Eh, sure. We'll take a little haunt. It's not terrible. Not what I was wanting to see, but... Not terrible. Another key and a bomb. Ooh, two dingles, huh? Well, not gonna matter too much, honestly. And there we go. We do get an HP upgrade. Uh, I'll take it. We might use this in here. Or we might not. Okay, that's kind of an awful deal. And yeah, let's head on down. Again, we are making excellent time. Honestly. Uh, we've gotten pretty good items. Spectral, some sort of spectral tears is about the only thing I'd like to see. Like that, that's about it, really. Not anyone can play. Okay. And <laughs> we get another damage up and an HP upgrade, thanks to Stigmata. Um, I'll use a bomb here on this stone chest. We're already here. Hmm. No. Not gonna take the bibble. I'm not saying that it's not a good item to have for an active item, but I would rather stick with Guppy's Paw. Because right now with the red hearts that we have, it can give us a little bit of boost to our HP if we need it. And we may need that come, come boss rush, because I have full intentions of completing boss rush. Come on. Just get away. That's actually one other thing I think we could use is some movement speed. There we go. Banner item room. Very good. Ooh, tech two, huh? Nice. Take me some tech two. What do we got in the shop? Go ahead and check it out. Uh, you know what? I'm going to donate this. Try to get some more shop upgrades. And there we go. Now, if for some reason we get the uh, the money, I might come back and get the compass because it can help us when it comes to um. <sighs> I'll check here for a secret room. When it comes to navigating, okay, we we might get the money right here. Uh, yeah, no, we'll be able to get compass for sure. Compass, excuse me, we will be able to get that for sure thanks to. Steam cell. Um, go ahead and use that. Map out the rest of the floor. So yeah, the compass is going to give us kind of like a pseudo mapping. It's going to show us where things are, kind of. So like our boss room, uh, item room, shop, things like that. Be very handy. We might be able to get... Really? Game, I don't want it. I do not want that. I don't care that much about having the Bible. Just leave it alone. Not that worried about the money right there either. Um, yeah. Here we go, the adversary should be... Ah, this will be a somewhat of a simple fight. 
The movement speed would not hurt us. I can't say that. There we go. Getting all stats. Thanks to the Halo. And I'm not just not a fan of Dead Sea Scrolls. I'm not. I'll do that. Are you a wizard? Oh boy. And there we go. So yeah, I think you see now on our map, the compass has shown us everything. Um, I bet the outer moon we actually have to go up. Okay, we get some bombs here. Very good. We can check here for a secret room. And we did get it. So that means we can get into the outer room with just a bomb. And they're spectral tears, thanks to Ouija board. All right. Now, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this because this does count as meaningful damage to boost our, well, to boost our damage stat. go so I'm gonna do that and then I might see if we can't get some red hearts just real quick we got I didn't mean to do that we have yeah we got plenty of time Bam, look at this. No problem. Okay, empty room. Got two chubs here, no problem. I mean, I guess I'll check the shop. Ah, wow, okay, I walked right into that. Yep. Yep. <sighs> not not my greatest move. And it's it was just super greed. Actually, is that a tears up pill? I think it was. Yes, it is. Might as well. Seems like red hearts aren't going to happen. So, I guess we just go ahead and fight. Fight mom's foot. Actually, you know, I could. I'll blow up the temperance machine and see. You know what that? Fine. All right, here we go. Mom's foot. Get this take. Get her taken out real quick here. Real quick. Oh, yes. Um, do that. Do that. Yeah, sure, why not? Do that. We have... We're going to have plenty of HP. Now, I'm hoping there's actually something in Boss Rush that's pretty nice. And you know what? Um, I'm going to take... You don't take Vampire Bat. Ooh. Now we are going to do Boss Rush here. So, I have full faith in our abilities. Yeah, this is going pretty good so far. Man, 
Look at that. Just getting after it here. Holy. Monstro, Chad, nothing. They are nothing. Chubb, Gertie, gonna be the same thing. Oh, well, whoop. walked right into that. Monstro 2 and Gish, okay. Let Monstro do a little damage there on Gish. At least it looked like he did. Yeah, this is this is going pretty good. And with Vampire Bat, we I mean now yeah, we we're fully healed on Red Heart HP. Not that it really matters because I plan on using it with Guppy's Paw. Or spinning them on double deals. But I mean whatever. This all works. I think we're going to be getting pretty close. Almost caught us. Got the fallen here. And there we go, we unlock Samson's Chains, which, eh, kind of just whatever, but we did it. Boss Rush is now complete as Samson. Uh, there's nothing in here. Yeah, let's head on down. Okay, so there's our boss. There's the curse room if we want to go there, which, ah, you know what, sure. Okay, I went the wrong way. Yay me! My amazing navigational skills. Let's keep on keeping on. I think we just about got him. Yep, there we go. We know there's a mini-boss fight up there. I'm not going to worry about that. I'll check the curse room to see if there's anything of use. Sometimes you can find a, a good item. Sometimes. And what I will do, though, is see if we can't get in there for free through a uh, secret room. No. Okay. That's only going to cost us one heart, so... Kind of just whatever. And now we will head to our boss. Doing good. Yeah, we are flying through this. I mean, just absolutely... Destroying. No, no, it's not like a super flashy kind of destroying, but uh, it's pretty good nonetheless. All right, Mr. Fred, you are going to be Mr. Dead here. Sorry, bud. Those two shots from uh, Tough Love. Do a nice little extra bit of damage. And done. Just like that. Get another tears up. Shot speed down, but it's kind of just whatever. Uh, I mean, I'll take it just because, but it doesn't do anything for us. And there we go. Let's head on down. Oh, we got some things here. Okay. We have a vault. We also have a library, which is interesting. Um, 
Let's go up here and check the curse room. Like I said, we... Plenty of time. In fact, there's really no time constraint right now. Other than just not having this recording last for, you know, uh, I don't know, an hour. <laughs> I don't care about the Monty. Check our curse room. Ooh, yes. That is nice. Another damage up. So our damage is not that high, but it really doesn't have to be. Not really. We keep going down here. Ugh. Stupid moles. I'll go ahead and use Guppy's paw. That way we're just back up to full. And yeah, we'll just keep on going. Very good. Check our library here. Ooh, Book of Belial and Anarchist Cookbook. Um, Book of Belial would give us a boost to our damage. Which would, I mean, that affects tech 2, that affects our size and our flies. Mm. Ah, let's stick with Guppy's Paw. I feel like we need to up our damage. We can always take damage, then use Guppy's Paw. That way we should never, at least on paper, we should never necessarily have to worry about... Um, a shortage in health. Um, I'll check for super secret room. Nope. Nope. Okay. Let's go fight mom's heart. Get this fight out of the way and see if we are heading to shoal or the cathedral. It's going to be one of the two. Yep. Like I said, even though our damage stat isn't necessarily all that high because of the flies and everything, it's it looks good. Like it's good on paper. I promise. And we are going to Shoal, so let's get down there. Alright, got a couple of unlocks there with Fighting Baby and the Kota. Uh, which way? Huh. You know what? Let's just check for something here first. Nope. Okay. Let's go this way. Uh, oh. I did not see you there, Cage. Thanks for making yourself known. I appreciate that. Just about done. Ah, yes. Couple more bombas here. Yeah, let's go down this way. Probably wouldn't hurt for us to take some damage. Like, some meaningful damage. If we can find it. Okay. Or we can just take regular damage, I guess. Like, that works too, I suppose. Go and use one there. Uh, let's see. Let's get the fires. No. Free soul heart. Uh, somewhat free. Never hurts. Get away from me, little haunts. Yeah. A little meaningful damage never hurts. Those were obviously not meaningful. 
like I said, it never hurts because it's just going to improve our damage stat. You probably have to go to the right. Uh huh. I seen what he was trying to do there. Too bad it didn't work for him. Check for secret room. Yes, there it is. Couple of keys, kind of just whatever. Okay. Gosh dang. It's okay, it just improves our damage. Ah, uh, that's a waste. I should know that the super secret room's not going to be there. Wow. Okay. Not there. Check right here. No. No. Oh, well, let's go fight. Come on. There we go. Falling already, just getting absolutely decimated here so some of this comes down to our flies also let's not forget our little guppy flies some of it is also just because we have some really good stats thanks to the items we've received I mean yeah it's just a it's a good build it really is so there we are pretty easy run I, I gotta say that was a pretty easy run um ooh, unlocked blood rights huh all right yeah so looking good on that um should hopefully be getting close to unlocking some other things should be we'll see but yeah hey until next time if you like the video Give it a like. If you dislike, give it a dislike. Let me know why you dislike the video in the comments. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Until the next run, see ya.